All right, guys, I am back and I am doing the 60 minute color challenge and this week is red. And so I'm using a couple of different kits and or papers. Um, these, I'm gonna flip through them really quick. These are from um, Amy over at Glamping, it's Glamping and Glitter on Etsy. And I, her shop is closed right at the moment, but she said um, that she plans to reopen here soon. Um, so these are some of the things that she'll have in her shop. Um, and I'm sorry, Amy, I can't remember what you had titled them, but it's just some pages that had some red and some trims I thought would be fun to use um, for some collaging. And then I'm also using probably bits and pieces from... Um, Tina at Shabby Dabby Doo Dahs. Um, oh, snap. I can't remember the kit. Um, I'll come back to it a little bit, but I've already cut the ephemera, so it would make it a little quicker. Um, so, and then I'll probably be using some of the background pages for um, also collaging. So, oh my gosh, I can't remember what the name of it is now. Um, Victorian something. It'll come to me, and you'll see them as I'm using them. Um, yeah, so yeah, there's that. And then I thought everything kind of paired well with Amy at Crafty Cat's new kit, and I can't remember the name of this kit either. Apparently my, blank, my brain is just gonna go blank today. Um, so we'll be using this in an upcoming video um, in, a, in a bit, um, but I wanna make some ephemera for that particular project. Um, so it, you know what I think it's called cabinet cards is the new kit. Um, and it's got some interesting pieces in there, some red shoes, um, some red flower and butterflies, and it's got some tags and then it's got, um, some tickets, a pocket, um, and then it's got all kinds of cabinet cards. But when it comes to filming that particular design team project, I'll, I'll flip through the whole kit when we get there, but it's really a cool kit. Um, yeah, so and then here's some of the papers that you get in that kit, and I think I might have printed them all, I'm not sure. But yeah, it's kind of a neat little kit here. Yeah, so and then there's like this album piece, which I think will look really, really cool on the cover, but I, that one hasn't like come to I don't want to say exact, but yeah, it hasn't really, I know where I want to go with it, but I'm not anywhere close to being able to tell you what kind of journal it's going to be per se. Um, so yeah, let's just get started. And um, just so anybody who's new to my channel and doing this challenge, I cannot record, record, save, and upload an hour video. So mine usually run about um, 55 to 58 minutes when I'm doing this and then I sew off screen. Um, it is cheating a little bit but I can't, I cannot get my um, phone to load anything over that amount of time. Um, it just, it won't do it, period. So right now, what I'm doing is just taking off the edges, obviously, so that we can do a little bit of collaging with this. Um, yeah, so I think we're going to make some journal cards. And then I've seen some really cool things lately on um, other people's channels, so I thought we might give some of that a whirl. Um, and then I saw some cute things on Pinterest that I would like to try, and we'll just see how much we actually get done. And I think I forgot my brads. Um, yeah, so I've just brought over quite a few and this part of it may feel like I'm cheating and you would probably be right a little bit, but I wanna do some library pockets and I already have some made up and I've already got some tag shape type things um, made up that I brought. And then, yeah, just some other little things that I wanna decorate with. Um, oh, and I'll probably be using Miss Cogs, and I think the other one is from Artsology, some of the ladies in those kits. 
Um, so yeah, I'll be using some of those, I think. Yeah, and just really all kinds of things, I think. Um, so I think I'm going to start on these. And I'm not going to be overly fussy about about where it's all being placed per se. It'll be the decorating that comes into the red, I think. Um, so I kind of wanted this in here, though. So on that other part down on the pocket. Um, yeah, so uh, I did record my um, Happy Mail video earlier. And, um, yeah, I was saying how weird the day was, and then I never finished telling you why it was so weird. It was really just, I don't know if anything specifically was weird about it, but as far as, like, memorable. But it's just, you know, those days where your brain just won't continue to work, no matter what you do. I think I put that low enough, did I? Yeah, I think that will still work. And then I'll probably sew around a lot of these. Um, these were just like quick little things that I did. Um, I don't know how many of you know this, but I can't really like sit still. Um, if there is um, <clears throat> something to be done, I like I just I can't sit still. Um, I think I've been that way my whole life. I have to be doing something. Always doing something. And so yeah. Sometimes if I don't really have a project going, which isn't really lately, <laughs> I'm a pretty busy girl. But yeah, um, I'll sit in the evenings um, while Grace and I are catching up on like The Good Doctor or Grey's Anatomy or something like that. Because her and I really do like to watch the medical shows together. Um, and those of you who are new probably don't know who Grace is. Grace is my daughter. And she is amazing of course um but also she's very she's just very supportive my son is too oh and i probably should show you he's pretty proud of this slowly but surely he's working on um a kit that we can um list in the shop and do i still have his drawing over here i do check this out isn't that gorgeous um, well, not my list, but isn't that beautiful? So he's slowly creating stuff for me. And I think that will be featured on another video. Um, I think I'm going to leave that and then we're going to put some contrasting in here. Um, Yep, we are still working at the tax office too. I have no idea how long that's going to keep going, at least for me. Because um, <clears throat> technically, obviously, the 15th is today. That Well, not today. For me, it's still Monday. For you, it's Wednesday. So I apologize in advance if I'm not overly talkative. Like I said, it's been one of those one of those days. I think lately I've just been getting overwhelmed because my mind won't shut off. And I do need to cover up most of this because obviously you can tell these were made when I wasn't really for sure what I was doing. So yeah, um, well like I couldn't really find any of my doilies. How ridiculous is that? Yeah, I felt really dumb. Actually, I think I'm just going to glue that down. Um, I still can't find the big pack of these. Like I have some, but I don't know where I put them. It was all my reorganizing in... February and January. Yeah, I organized so well, I organized myself into losing things, apparently. Oh, 
Well, that is terribly complicated today, huh? <laughs> um, yeah, so I think these are fun little kits we're going to use um, in an upcoming journal. And like I said, I don't know that it'll be like a design team per se, but it'll definitely be... Um, using design team people's graphics. Does that make sense? So I do think I'm going to get some of these pretty little roses out. focal point. There is some circles in these. Is that too big? That is too big. <clears throat> Here's another one. It's almost too big too, huh? Yep. Let's do that. I'm just going to cut off the little banner piece and use it a little bit differently. Hope you all are doing well. We are still faring pretty well. Oh, snap. You know what I didn't bring? I didn't bring my little uh, cream and brown. This stuff. really just don't know what to talk about today. And what else do we want? Um, maybe we should try a little bit of flat laces maybe. Get out my little box of glory, as Gracie calls it. Maybe this piece here. Oh no, okay. Oh, where's your head? My head is nowhere in particular, I guess. So, what is everybody up to?
Just covering up a large portion of that doily, huh? Nope, I don't really like that. Oh, well, maybe if you move it in like that, I think that looks okay. I'm gonna go ahead and start gluing some of it at least. I guess the goal is to stop thinking so much about it, right? Like, um, I think sometimes we overthink things. I do think I'm going to cut that down just a little bit. Who knew I'd need all the glue? Wow, this one little piece is taking quite a while, huh? Can you imagine if I hadn't done any like beginning prep work for it? And then we need something right there. Um, did bring along some little flowers. thinking like um, I was thinking almost something like small doily-ish but I don't know that I have any small doily stuff left I think I've kind of used it, which is good, right? That's why people send me stuff, so I'll use, ooh, wait, I do have something a little doily-ish. And I did go ahead and plug in my hot glue, because, you know, time. <gasps> oh my gosh, I just stuffed that whole box everywhere. Oh, a par for the course, right? It's Monday. Okay, there's a little doily here. My glue gun is on its last leg. It doesn't like to heat up very well, and then when it does, it's like kind of finicky. Which I'm guessing if I go to the store, I'm not going to be able to find any of those either. All right. That looks cute, I think. We'll call that one a piece almost done. Let's do a little journaling card, which I did already bring some book pages over. But where they are, I don't know. Um, well, I guess we'll just make another one, won't we? And I am going to, like I said, stop and go off camera and go um, 
probably uh, sew these when we get done. I seem to be getting slower and slower with these. Like the first like two, I was like, bam, got it done. Now it just feels like it's taking me forever to get one done. Like one... want to be kind of simple. How about we do? believe how like uh like it just won't be spring you know what I mean it's snowing here again ridiculous I tell ya oh maybe I should have put something else on there first like music Yeah, I have no idea what book that came out of, but... I think Gracie and I are done making masks for now. Um, yeah, I think I think we are spent. I think we got our our little uh, got it all out of our system, if you will. <laughs> Grace are watching a uh, Bumblebee the Transformer movie. It's like Grace's favorite series is the Transformers, which I, seems weird. Seems like it's more a boy show than anything else, but um, she really likes it. I mean, I don't know. I don't know that that's necessarily true either, but. I think this day and age, it's whatever floats your boat, right? And those sure float her boat. I need to re-ink my ink pad. Alright, so there's one, or two, I guess, depending on how you look at it. And sew around those. 
you imagine how long it would be taking me if I didn't have these already made? All right, let's try an envelope. Hit this. Can go here. go ahead and leave this as a pocket like on a page so it'll be glued down right it'll still yeah it'll still glue down <clears throat> nope I might have to run and go grab another glue stick we are just about out of this one then the nerves get going because I don't know if I'm gonna be able to order any more in Right now, I mean, of course, in like a month or two, probably, but. That's weird. I didn't sew at the top. Hmm. Well, no worries. We can remedy that. Oh, what was I doing? See what I mean? I'm kind of scattery. to use and we may end up having to turn this one into like two episodes too like I did last week because I'm almost a hundred percent certain I won't won't be done playing by the time it's time to turn off the video so you guys might just get two hours of red play which I think like three of you will be super excited about that because you like red but and then I have another really exciting thing that I want to do I literally have projects like my brain is so overflowed with project ideas right now um, so I'm gonna do this April challenge and I'm gonna videotape it um, in one of my Facebook groups and I think you guys will all really enjoy it I think it'll be a fun little thing. Mm, not enough difference, huh? Maybe we should try different. anything little in her kit I don't think this kit really comes with little oh um, it does kind of come with tag like uh, tickets all right well oh, that one might do better
might be a little better. I don't really have a whole lot to talk about. Um, um, it's, I, yeah, I don't have anything I think worthy of like talking about in like life-wise. Um, we don't have anything exciting. I mean, Paul's still hauling, so then there's stuff for him to haul, so that's good. Um. No news on the 4-H score, whether we're actually going to have fair or not. We're still kind of waiting to hear on that. Uh, most of all the FFA stuff is canceled along with school, so yeah, there's that. Other than that, I don't really know too much more. Let's see. squeeze a little bit out of this one. Oh, I need to put something there too, huh? Just when you think, right? quickly trying to scan that to make sure there wasn't any bad words because like I said I don't even remember what book it came out of now one can never be too careful with dollar store books which I'm assuming that's where this one came from um in your ear. All right, where did it go now? There it is. You guys probably saw it, didn't you? Just below. 
line. Gosh, sorry. Sorry, sorry about your ear balls. I don't know what it is today with my glue, but it's more cloggy than normal. It's probably because it's tired of me leaving its cap open. And let's see, we need something down in one of these corners. Um, and there's this really cute, it's too big. I think these are too big too. Kind of what we're going for. Maybe we just go ahead and do, find one of those other, like another one of those, um, doilies like we did a minute ago if I can I said I don't know I got kind of lucky there that one doesn't have any so I wonder what would happen if we cut some of these doilies down I probably ought to go through and reorganize that or if we just cut the pieces out of it like a little corner piece without that though and scissors are on the ground well I really want to get to the one thing I was thinking of earlier too big so I'll cut that in half and maybe use it on something else too Or since that one has it on that side, maybe we should put it on this side. Nope, I like it on the other side. Decisions, decisions, huh? And we're just going to keep going with the same motif here. Oh, would you look at that? I left the lid out, or the pen out of my glue again. Okay, I think I like that. We might add a little something green in there later, but I think for now I like that. Okay. Then, I think this book page from, oh, gosh darn it, I don't really want to do that. I saw this really cool thing, but it's very similar to what we're already doing with book page, but it was a tag that they made. This is the stuff I got from Lori um, at Grammy's Keepsakes. Um, she was kind enough to send me some book papers. Um, when I was working on the other Lori's um, custom journal back in like November. Okay. 
this works with. Well, I was going to rip it on both sides, but I think I think that just doesn't work very well anyways. So we're just going to kind of fake it till we make it. And I think I've seen this several times by other people, but um Now, let's see. I found this and it's pretty it's pretty red. And it's like a velvety type thing. And this one I'll definitely have to sew, but we'll at least get most of it put together. That's more like it. I think I'm just gonna have to glue it down. Like glue it into place and then trim around the edges. I'm really getting nervous. Are we really only getting three pieces done? I don't know, if I hurry, I could probably get more, but. something in there maybe um, something that does not really gonna matter if it gets gluey um, now I'm going to put yeah that's it Too, I'm not sure. All right, so we got that. I really want to be able to use this big circle piece, but I don't know that we're actually going to be able to use it on this stuff here. Yeah, you know, we're going to go for it. We're just creating, right? What's the worst that's going to happen? We hate it. Well, then we don't have to use it, right? Since we're already kind of doing these doilies, I think we might go ahead and just stick with it. Maybe. 
It might just be too big. Yep, too big. Too big. What do I got that's little? Ooh. I might have, let's see, here's a butterfly. Let's see, does this one have little doilies? It does. All right, so there's a little butterfly. We'll have to layer him up. But I do have little doilies left. I believe I got this one from Lori as well in her shop. Don't really like the butterfly, but I do have one or two of those hearts left if I can find them quickly. Like I said, that box fell, so it's anybody's guess now where everything is. Well, if it takes too long, then we're just going to have to pick out something else, huh? Hmm. Well, gosh darn it, I don't know where those other two hearts went. Not without like dumping over the whole box and I'm like seriously wasting time. Ooh, but how about this? Um So I take away from the red, it takes away from the red. Oh my goodness, sorry guys. Oh, that's such a bummer. I think those little hearts would probably go really well there too. Well, shoot. What else do we got? All right, well, that doesn't look terrible. What else can we do for vintage? Let's try. It's gonna have to be flowers of some type, right? What else do we got over here? Vintage tickets. I could throw a couple of those in to the mix. Nope. I actually don't mind that. Let's try a couple other things here with it. And what about some of Laura's pretty little bling here? Nope, not quite right for this one. What if we did three of the little red roses? another idea too. And times just keeps on moving, moving, moving. Okay. I'm going to find one little cream lazy piece over here. Not quite the hearts I was looking for, but I think it will do in a pinch, maybe. Maybe 
third one. I probably should have been gluing this down as I go. Yeah, I think we're just gonna go for it. Time's a wasting. I'm getting kind of irritated my glue gun's not working well. Or should we have it in the middle? I don't really like it off center. But maybe not too off center because I'm still gonna want to sew around that. All right, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna pause the video, go sew around my three little lone pieces here, and then I'll be right back and we'll finish decorating it. All right, see you in a minute. Okay guys, we have like four minutes and 20 seconds to finish this up. And hopefully my glue gun is not being a stinker again. Maybe it was just like a clog or something. I don't think that we have time in this particular video to make anything to go inside of this. So I'm just gonna finish decorating it. Ugh, glue strings. That's why I don't like using glue stick or uh, hot glue guns very often, but. Um, I do like it on these projects because it's fast setting. And you know what might help is if I got my little spatula out. And I don't know where it is right at the moment. It's up in my little thing and I don't see it right away, so. That was warm. All right. Three minutes or not, I gotta grab that spatula. Or this. This will work for a second. I think I better put a little bit of glue there. All right. Then we're going to put these little guys in there. it's definitely time to reorganize my tools because it's probably sitting like really close and I just don't know where oh am I even gluing that on screen my apologies, guys. Seems I'm all over the board today. Man, that hour went fast, though. I will say that. Okay, so I'm going to call this pocket done. And I don't think we'll try it. We will try. Okay, so another thing that I've seen that I thought might be kind of cute to go in that. Um, and then I'm probably just going to end up losing it, right? Or not. Of course, I probably won't have time to back it, but I don't. All right, so that old book page is not gonna work. All right, it looks like we are gonna have to just come back and this one is from Laura. It's one of the newest ones. Red shoes almost seems to go perfectly with this, doesn't it?
do want that red shoes to show. Okay, so then, um, oh, that's it, guys. Um, so, oh, I have my volume down apparently. Okay, so we only really got technically three things done in this little hour here. I mean, they're pretty little things though. I do like that. Um, yeah, so I think maybe I will stop. Obviously I have to stop this video and load it. And then I think I'll just kind of continue on, um, through this and kind of make a few more red pieces while I'm at it and I have everything out. So I guess I will see you guys soon. Thanks Amy for this challenge. It is, um, definitely a challenge. I am enjoying it. All right. Bye guys.